everyone has their limits. In life, human nature is to test the limits. Um, as an example, when you're in the gym and you're working out, you put the weight to a limit that you can comfortably do. And then over time, you may increase it to your maximum weight. And then you're at your limit. If you go past your limit, you'll hurt yourself. And you can apply that principle to dealing with people, remembering that you have a limit and they have a limit, and try to remember your limits so that you have empathy, but try to remember that you have a right for boundaries. Because no matter how compassionate, how loving you are, how fair you are, you have to remember that you're human. And they're human. Even your parents, even your pet, you know, in one sense, I mean, you know, they're just living beings. Everyone's got a limit, okay? Everyone's got a limit. And minimalism, minimalism even plays a part in that, right? Because I think as humans, um, we consume and we gather and we hoard because we want to survive and it's any, even living being, again, whether even you'll see it in the animals, animals don't like to share. They like to collect everything and then they protect their territory. And humans, they have storage units. They have a lot of extra square footage. They have a lot of uh, too big a car. Uh, they risk too much. All of us, we go through life where we test our limits. And if you put too much on yourself with regards to materialism and taking on too much risk financially and emotionally, having too many relationships, having too many pets, having another mouth to feed, emotionally, emotionally, financially, physically, if you put too much on yourself, if you go past your limit, you'll hurt yourself. Just like when you're in the gym. If you put too much weight past your limit, you're going to, you know, strain your muscle. You're going to hurt yourself. You're going to pop your knee. And remembering that we have limits, remembering that, yeah, it is our job to, you know, push ourselves and to get the most out of ourselves. And so there is something to be said that, you know, and, and like I say, it always starts with getting up early. You know, like when you get up early and you push yourself out of bed, right? It's like, that's not easy. There's resistance there. There's gravity. Um, there's emotion there. You got to push, you know, you got to lift that weight of yourself up. And, you know, but you got to be able to do that. Because if you can't do that, you can't do anything else in life, you know. And if you want your independence, you want to tell yourself you can do that. You know, and that's the sales pitch for doing things you don't want to do. Do you want to be independent or do you want to be dependent on other people? I like independence. And so when you push yourself out of bed, that's right there. You know, you're putting some capacity to use. And you should use your gifts, your smarts, your physical abilities, your mental abilities, your emotional abilities. You just don't want to go beyond, okay? You want to push yourself, you don't want to go beyond. And same thing when dealing with other people. You're going to find, oh, this person, there, You know, and that's why there's a lot of conflict in the world. Because most people in their life, in their personal life, financially, emotionally, they're, they're maxed out. You know, like they're they're maxed out on the credit card. They're maxed out on the uh, amount of car they should own. They're maxed out on the amount of houses they should have. They're maxed out on the amount of risk they should take in the marketplace. And one thing, one extra thing at work, one extra thing driving, and it pushes them over the limit. And that's why it's important to take care of yourself, self-care. That's why it's important to minimalism, but it's also important to push yourself because you can't just play defense, you have to play offense. You have to balance. You got to win the game, right? You, got, you can't just save money, you got to make money. <laughs> yeah. You need rest, but you also need to wake up. You need both. Just like the gym. You can't just, you know, you can't just look at the weights, you got to lift them. So if you lift weights, then you understand that you got to put in the work to make money. Okay. Everything in life, guys, it's it's a defense and offense. Okay. And in proportion to limits and what you're trying to do, et cetera, et cetera. And we, I push the limits. We push the limits. But I'm always very cautious of, okay, am I going out to the limit? Hey, I'm hurting myself. There's a lot of things in life, a lot, are self-induced. 
And I, I acknowledge that to myself. I said, Sam, I'm hurting myself here. I got to mitigate my risk here. I got to add some comfort here. I got to push myself there. And that's what, you know, you got to evaluate as an adult. And if you can't do it, someone's going to have to do it for you. And when someone, has to, someone else has to do it for you, you ain't going to like it. You ain't going to like when someone has to wipe your butt. You ain't going to like when someone has to tell you, make sure you, you make it here by 11 o'clock or else you ain't getting this. Or you, ain't get, you better do what you got to do for you. And I hope this video helped. If it did, click the thumbs up because if, if your limit is just watching videos, and most people do, 50% of people, their limit is just to watch, which I appreciate. There's another 10, 20% take the time to click that thumbs up, even though it's free and it's right there, take the time. You say, well, I watch on my TV. 50% of people watch me on my TV. You know how many of them will take the effort to get their smartphone, to get their laptop and go on the video and click the thumbs up? Not that many. Why? It takes effort. And they're already maxed out in their other parts of their life. They want everything free and easy. How many people will share the video? Less than 10%. All those things are free, but I'll tell you guys, they got to reach. they got to push. Okay. God forbid you can go beyond free. Forget about it, guys. I mean, I, but let me, let's just stand on the free stuff, guys. <laughs> Thank you for watching.